So the first thing we do is, if the tarp is on, take it off and just unhook it from the back. And then roll it up with this reel here. trailer and the next most important thing is to latch the gates open and whenever you open the gates there's a hook and then a little ring right here that just gets put around that hook and so whenever we dump it it keeps the gates from opening up oh, it's ready to dump. Um, another thing that we always make sure of is that the trailer is on a level surface and that whenever you drive forward to finish dumping it that all that area is going to be level too that way because if it gets unlevel you know there's a potential of the trailer tipping over and then inside the box here we pull out the remote and just make sure you put the cord through one of these slots that way it doesn't get pinched trailer reaches its peak height you want to immediately stop lifting it um, so it doesn't bog down too much and then whenever you're actually pulling the truck forward sometimes if it's a full load and you don't want to drag the load out into a large space you can pull forward and dump about half of the load and then actually back up you know a few feet pushing the load closer together and then pull forward to dump the rest of it out Another important thing is when we're lowering the trailer, if the battery is ever dead, you won't hear the motor running as you're lowering it. And if that happens, it's important not to lower the trailer unless we hook it up to jumper cables or uh, get power to it because it will still go down without power, but it will cause the hydraulic fluid to actually be pushed out of the reservoir, which isn't good for it. Make sure we put the cable and the remote back in the box and latch the box shut again. And then close the gates. 